Yeah, we need to up our our pistol skill. We will eventually. Oh, oh some trick moves there, darling. Welcome back, everybody, to Seven Days to Die. I'm the Bearded OG. And our spikes are killing another screamer down there. Um, Yeah, so we are going to go out and do some more jobs today. That's the plan. Uh, a couple things to go over, though. First of all, we have um, Meet Hugh Challenge. So let's do that. Um, I'm going to make a cigar. Do I do that in my own inventory? Yes, I do. I'm going to craft a stogie. And I also have parts here to make another hunter mod, which we're going to put on our bow. So let's get that crafting up. And then um, from yesterday's foray, we found this 44 Magnum. So I'm going to go ahead and carry that instead of the 9, at least until we run out of ammo. Of course, I can make more ammo too if we need to. Uh, so we'll sport this for a bit. I do have a couple of 44 skills. Um, the Magnum Enforcer. So I've got the 10% more damage with guns. We can make high power ammo. And the sprinting in combat uses 20% less stuff. <laughs> uh, let's see. What else have we done? Um, I think that's pretty much it. We could, uh, we can make nine more steel arrows to top off our arrows. So why don't we do that? And I got to get some more pipe, uh, pipe bombs going too. That's just making water right at the moment. It's got six seconds left. Okay, so the cigar will give us one point of strength and plus ten bartering. Uh, I also, oh yeah, right. I do have the Raider helmet on now, um, just because it's a level five piece and 50% sun resist does not suck, but we're going to have to get rid of one of these and I'm not really too worried about being silence. So this is going to be a permanent thing that we will always have from here on out. Um, so that's amazing because let's get the hunter mod out of here. And I got some more pipe bombs that'll just stick in this little thingy here for the moment. Put that back in there. And let's stick this on our bow right now. We do 71.2 damage. Now we do 76.3 plus 25% more damage to critters. Um, that was, uh, we have this on our lever action too. So I'm sure that was helping us take those bears down pretty quickly. We need plastic to make steel arrows. Get those going. Oh, mini bike. That's right. We can make the mini bike. How did I forget that? Uh, let's do that next, actually. All right. So we will track. Uh, we're gonna, we have the handlebars, so we've got those for rewards. So we're going to have to make the chassis. All right. So... I knew there was something important that we needed to do and it had escaped me until just now. Oh, the duct tape's going to be a pain in the ass. All right, well, we got one piece there. Um, we can do it. I just hate spending water on it is all, but it is what it is. Electrical part. Okay, so let's grab some cloth and... Um, I mean, we've got a, almost 20 clean water, but here again, I would prefer to use that for cooking. But we need to make four uh, more, so let's grab some bones. That's going to take 52 seconds, so we got enough time there. All right, so while we're waiting for that, um, what else? Uh, what do we need for just the main mini bike? We're going to need two wheels. 
And I have eight wheels. And we're going to need an engine and a battery. And the battery quality doesn't matter. It used to, but it doesn't anymore. I don't know. It's just another one of those things that they dumped down, which I don't really agree with. But it does make things easier on us right at the moment. Of course, I did have some higher level batteries that I sold that I would not have sold had I, you know, had that still be a requirement. But it's not, so we're good. Okay, get this last glue. The other nice thing, of course, about having the mini bike is we're going to have a lot more storage, too, compared to the bicycle, anyway. Alright, so we need a mini bike chassis. Oh, what am I missing? Oh, right, I gotta make that into duct tape. Wait a minute, did that say six duct tape? Oh shit, it did. Uh, only made four glue. Tell you what, man, glue has just been the bane of my existence. Oh, it was in there, I guess it, I didn't let it finish. My bad. I was right the first time, I was wrong the second time. I mean, it hasn't been that bad, but it has been a bit of a pain in the ass. Chemistry station will make that, uh, improve that situation. Speaking of which, how far away are we from the chemistry station? Workstations. We are only seven. Only seven away. Okay, so that shouldn't take too, too long. All right, now let's turn this into duct tape. And when that's done, then we should be able to make the chassis. Got a nice collection of steel built back up there. Put that over here. Okay, mini bike chassis will take one and a half minutes. So let's get that going. And then we're also going to need fuel, so we've got to... Decent collection of fuel, but I'm going to have to go around, of course, and do some major wrenching since we can't make oil shale until we get the chemistry bench. And we might uh, we might actually need a skill for that, too. Uh, or not oil shale, sorry, gas. No, it looks like we'll be able to make it. We just need the chem bench. So I guess that's no longer gated behind a skill. The, the big stacks are, but that's okay. Um, nope. 44 seconds. What are you doing? You're not doing anything. Um, okay. I think... Well, I've definitely got more stone I can melt down, but right now I've been working on the, on the steel. So it's nice to have a full stack of that and then some. But we're going to need it for several things, so I'll keep making it until I, you know, run out of iron, and then we'll switch back over to making more cement. Aren't you done yet? Do you have any idea how long I've waited for you, mini bike? Way too long. Of course, I should have put a point in the mechanic thing, and I just didn't think about it, but oh well. <laughs> okay, here we go. Another minute and 30 seconds. Ah, you're killing me. <laughs> All right. You guys have any more water? Not yet. They were they were uh, chocked full when I, when I got home last night. Uh, speaking of which, we did have um, an unevent... Well, mostly an eventful trip home. Nothing major happened. But what I did is this is where Trader Hugh is. And I got on this highway and just followed it through here. And it intersected uh, with this highway here and got us right back to town. It's a lot shorter way to get there than this way is. Well, it's not a lot shorter, but it's shorter uh, for sure. So Hugh is now going to be on our circuit for traders. And he does have that really nice um, State 32, right? He's got that blue assault rifle, but I don't. I don't see how. I mean, well, okay, I'll tell you what. If I got on the mini bike and I just spent the day salvaging, we could we could easily raise enough money to go buy that. I might do that. I don't know. We'll see. Um, 
If I'm going to do that, though, we need to do it today because he resets tomorrow. I think it was day 33, right? Hmm. We can go look at Rekt and see uh, what he's got. Oh, almost there, guys. Oh, this is a beautiful thing. All right. Huzzah. We are now in the minibike era. I've got some spikes I'm going to have to fix, too, because we had a horde come through last night. This looks like a, a tote goat. It's, it's funny. You know, the model. All right. We are going to grab everything out of you. And you will just keep for backup emergency purposes. Uh, oh. Oh, that didn't take long to refuel. I thought we would have to do that a couple times. All right. And then we'll, as usual, keep our medical stuff in here. But we've got three times the space that we had in the bicycle. So that's just great. Love it. Um... I don't think I have any mods for this. We've got three slots. Can I make the fuel saver mod? I know I don't have it, but this is what I have for mods at the moment, and none of those are vehicle mods. Let's look at something here. Fireman's Axe mod. What does that do again? More damage to blocks, less damage to enemies. I'll make that at some point, but not right now. Yeah, this is as far as we can go. So it doesn't look like I can make any of the vehicle mods yet. But that will come in time. Okay, let's just store you in there. I do have a couple things to sell to Rekt. What is this price? 88. Eh. I mean, my tools are kind of in rough shape and I've just been really stingy with repair kits. I don't, yeah, I don't think I'm going to burn, burn a tool on that. Uh, oh, sorry, a repair kit. But let's put you on. Oh, we're going to have to remember to, oh, this is going to be a pain in the ass. I, maybe I should make two of those. I mean, we probably will eventually, but we're going to have to remember to switch the that over when we trade trade with Rector. Ow! This thing scoots along pretty good. It's got, like, really fast acceleration. I'm just so used to the slow start of the bike, I guess. That, th that thing just took right off. Oh, this is so great, you guys, that we have this now. I gotta say, I'm pretty happy about that. Alright, let's see when he resets, and then that'll kind of decide what I'm gonna do here. Stop staring, asshole. You know the drill, asshole. Okay, well, so those two things. Um... Oh, okay, so if he restocks on day 34, then that means Hugh does too. So that we have two more days then. Um, have you reset or are you still? We want to actually start looking for Forge Ahead magazine since we're seven away from the Kim bench. He still has this. Uh, no, sorry, this. 4860. That's so expensive for a level one. But still a good weapon, though. Okay. Oh, you want a guarantee, huh? Well, maybe you should try Shamway. Well, all right. So since we have two days, I think we'll... What the hell's going on here? That's weird. I've never seen that happen before. Um, since we have two days, let's go ahead and do a job or two today. If we have time for two, we'll do one for sure. 
and then I think I'll go ahead and salvage overnight and or during the day tomorrow for at least part of the day and then we can head over to Hughes and get that blue assault rifle it's gonna be a very nice upgrade for us we'll be jumping from an orange AK to a blue assault rifle that's huge um, okay all right, guys, so I'm going to get uh, my ducks in a row here, and then I will meet you over at our job, which is, what is it? Working stiff tools. Um, yeah, okay. I'd like to do that anyway, because we might find some steel tool parts. Oh, speaking of which, if we did make a steel pick, an orange steel pick would take two steel tool parts. I have one. So if we do happen to find another steel tool parts in the hardware store, or even better, a steel tool itself, we can make this. So yeah, we'll, uh, we'll keep that in mind. Anyway, I'll see you over there in a little bit. All right, guys, we are at the tool store. Let's uh, grab some of this pre-loot. We won't go crazy, but we'll grab a few things. I don't... Is there concrete in here? That's... I think that's nitrate. And that's probably sand. Yeah, because it says sand. We have... um just stone and chrysanthemum and stuff but yeah I don't see anything significant in here for looting purposes there's resource purposes but not looting hey give me my arrow oh shit where did that come from surprised we didn't wake her up earlier must have been hanging out somewhere back here how in the hell did I not see her didn't we come Oh, I guess we came through here, right? Okay, never mind. <laughs> I'm like, God, what the hell, man? Oh, jeez. It's been kind of a long day. Um, I'll take that stuff. It is actually, in fact, the very the next day in real life since I recorded the last segment. So that's kind of what I meant by it's been kind of a long day. Uh, all right, let's go ahead and get this party started. This is a clear and retrieve. So let's get the wood again. Um, nope, don't want any of that stuff. Take the cornmeal and the seasoned meat. And neither one of these cars repopped. But well, the Zombos probably did. A little bit different spot. There we go. Get that one, and there's another red dot this way. Probably the same, more or less in the same position that the other one was in. I think I spot the head right there. All right. You're not going to give me my arrow back? Damn it, Jim. Well, we got those two arrows back at least. Okay. Let's check this. Arrows do not have a recipe. We'll eat them straight up. And I guess that's it for in here. All right, here we go. We'd very much like to find some steel tool parts in here because we can make an orange, well, we can make orange steel tools. The pick in particular is what I would like more than anything else. We woke up one or two. Where the hell are they? Hmm. 
having weird sound direction issues. Oh, back there? Yeah, I guess in the bathroom. But the question is, where are the other ones? Are they in the bathroom too? Oh fuck, it's feral. Thanks, Edgar. Oh shit! to a great start here. <laughs> Jesus. Wow. And it's not a lootable thingy. <sighs> okay. Let's start looting here. Come on, steal tool parts. It's Kniffy. Well, we got lots of toilet paper. Uh, there's something up here. Backpack. Lock picks. We'll take glue. Motor tool parts. Come on, goddammit. We have, like, Lucky Looter level 4. What is this shit? This is terrible. This is terrible loot. I mean, the lockpicks don't suck, but... What the hell? What the hell, man? I remember when tool stores used to be such a nice find. And, you know, back in the older versions of this game, you'd get some good shit from tool stores. Now it's just BS. It's all a bunch of crap. Okay, um, uh, let's go back out here and put a few things in here. Because we have all this wonderful space. We're not taking that. Um, I guess I'm going to take those because we are making pipe bombs, and I guess we'll keep 20 gunpowder. Not keeping iron. We don't need feathers really anymore um, because we're now making steel arrows, which requires plastic, which we do need. We'll sell that. And I guess I'll keep the bones for making glue. We want all of this stuff. All right. Man, it's so nice to have that extra space in the bike now. It is indeed. Do we get brass from taking these apart? If we scrap that, do we get brass? Yes, we do. Okay. I think those just give iron, so I'm not going to mess with those. Oh, that door's locked. All right, which way are we supposed to go? This way? That door's unlocked. All right, everybody loaded? Especially you. Oh, we got our magnum now, too. Might have to test this out. Uh, I don't really care about the dye. Well, we could turn it into paint. Not that even that really matters, because paint's so easy to make. Oh, that's a fat loot's room. Okay. Potatoes. Corn. Canned food. Uh... 
I want the red dye. Why don't we make our... Um, we'll make our bow red. Cool. Okay. Uh, wait, whoops. Already looked there. Both of those. That's it. Don't want that. Pick those up. Okay, outside we go. Go like the yard back here. Nope, not taking that. We'll take the paper though. And the concrete. Uh, we'll take this. Edgar. Wanted to get a, a quiet kill off on him so we don't wake everybody else up all at the same time here. Oop. Uh, scrap. This is an office. Okay, salvage tools. And salvage tools. Yes, that's it. Scrap and scrap and eat. We look there? Yeah. Um, I guess, are we supposed to go up on the roof? Let's get these back down here. We'll leave that behind. Alright, I see a victim. Try that again. Down with the sickness. Okay, I see another victim. And there's a red dot way over there. Uh, I think I see them lying in the corner. <laughs> Give me my arrow, Edgar. satchel. Um, there's also concrete and a chest back there. Working stiff. Handy lamp. Actually, yeah, there is more concrete in here. Or cement, to be precise. Is that it for cement? I think so. See, he's feral. Okay. Is he dead? Yeah, he's dead. Oh, shit. Nope. No spitting. I said no spitting. Out of stamina. All right. Have a magnum. Okay. Now we're 
worked. And that takes care of all the red dots back here. Locked. I guess we'll take that. Um, let's get the pipes from this. Might as well. Yeah, door's locked. Um, I'm going to go uh, do another drop off really quick here. And up the ladder we go. Make sure we're fully loaded here. Yeah, we need to up our our pistol skill. We will eventually. Oh fuck. Oh, some trick moves there, darling. Alright, that takes care of the Zikaroos. Darling jumped right on our head. I'm impressed. There's something here. What is that? Chicken. Eat it. Don't need feathers. Uh, we can maybe wrench those some other time. I always say that, but I almost never actually come back and do it. Sometimes I do, though. has been known to happen. All right, we got a working stiff. And another salvage tool. And some cement. Nice. Nothing else significant up here. What the hell? Sledgehammers and some more cement. Harvesting tools. Iron sledge quality two. Wrench quality six. All right, well, we won't be making a quality six wrench, but I might make a quality five wrench. Let's check the fat loots. Targets with full health took 20% more damage. Oh, yeah, I love that one. And this we could use in the snow if we need to. Uh, let's take that now because we are kind of hurt. And we'll sell that and, I don't know, do something with those. Let's go do our turn-in. Yeah, but overall, rather disappointed with this tool store. Like, bullshit. <laughs> Alright guys, this super corn is ready to harvest. Um, as is the rest of it. Let's let the spikes kill the screamer. The screamers, I should say, because they pretty much come in pairs these days. I got three super corn seeds back, so let's just replant those. And we'll replant these and grab whatever else we have in here. Potatoes and corn. Um just trying to decide if I want to actually grow something else for a change. How are we doing on coffee? Got 12 beans. <clears throat> yeah, let's do, uh, let's actually do some coffee beans. 
What are the recipes for this? We can make glue. So are, are we just talking one glue for two ears of super corn? That doesn't seem... That doesn't seem like a good exchange. And then, of course, we can use it for some of these high-end elixir things, which we're not really in a position to do much about. Okay, so I just want to see how much these will sell for. We got 12 ears. Okay, we want this, this, and this. We'll take our money with us. Um, Do I have... Ah, oh, shit. I didn't bring my glasses with me, but I'm not going back for them. I did, by the way, because you know, because we got two testosterones. I made another, a second cigar, and put them in my selling glasses, which I forgot to bring. Uh, wait, Get did I? Lost, bum. Yeah, I did. Well, look here. All boys. right. We got ourselves a real life hero. Uh, now he wants to be paid. He wants to be paid. Why don't we take? I guess the pipe bombs. None of that stuff's all that great, but this is. Only a tier two. Yeah, we'll just take those. Um, all right, inventory. What are you, a zombie? Decide already. Uh, oh, he doesn't want that. Okay, how much will you buy those for? See, 552 coin for 12 years of corn. That's pretty damn good. Um, so, yeah, let's do it. Okay, so that gets us up to 4,000. We need to get to 9,000 and something to get that blue uh, assault rifle, but I'm going to get the bulk of that from... Uh, salvaging cars. Now, he still has that level 1 pump, but I think I'd rather get the the blue tactical assault rifle. So, we're not going to get the level 1 pump. Thank you very much, and now you can go fuck yourself. You can go fuck yourself. Okay, this is a fetch and clear to the if south a job from me, at the D. Smith you residence. Deal. Disappoint me, and you'll find yourself on the wrong end of a rope. Yeah, yeah, whatever. All right, you guys. Um, I think yeah, we, we're gonna have to wrap up this episode. Um, so I'm gonna spend the rest of today just salvaging, uh, maybe even into the night too, and just get a whole mess of stuff. I'm just gonna hit like all the cars in town, um, and raise that money that we need, and then we'll probably take a trip back to Trader Hugh in the, uh, the next episode to tomorrow on day 33 and go get that tactical assault rifle. That is uh, the plan. So thanks everybody for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. And if you did, please hit that like button and subscribe to the channel. Leave a comment, share out the video and we'll catch y'all in the next episode. Bye.